And that's no jive. This is WHFS. We just heard uh, an excerpt from Proctor Bergman's uh, album, TV or Not TV, which is going to be a film, you say. It is. It is, it is already a film. Yes, yeah, so we have it in our suitcase. Yes, we're going to show parts of it on uh, Panorama tomorrow on Channel 5. What time? <laughs> well, we go on... We're taping it at 10.30. Oh, it'll be taped, so... 10.30, yeah. it's going to be shown at noon. No, it's, it's no. live, and it goes oh. from 12 to 2. Oh, Don't really? Smoke, <laughs> Don't smoke white cigarettes. It's live, and it goes from 12 to 2, eh? Oh. Yes, thank you. Yeah, they get me I just me wanted to mention that so they could hear it too. It's my sure. campaign against poison cigarettes. You don't smoke? That's good. Oh, yeah, I smoke regular like tobacco, untreated yeah. tobacco. Sure, yeah. cigars, sure, yeah. things like that, but not the stuff with the poisons in them. I know what you mean. Oh, Free Food and Drug Administration, are you listening? <laughs> it's a carbon monoxide in the cyanide in the papers caused by the burning high tar. Uh, it's also the central nervous system addicting alkaloid of nicotine that's sprayed on the tobacco. Speaking of central nervous systems, what oh, the... Have you ever, yeah, what? I wanted to know why... Uh, is there is there some alliance of bozos? I mean, is there such a thing as, as like a, uh, 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 well, the of bozos is an alliance to begin with. It's a brotherhood of zips and others. There you go. Not to be confused with Larry Harmon's bozo the clown. Beep beep. These are clones, right. not clowns. We tried to make that clear. Because I I'd often thought of you know there must be there must be like a a, uh, a union a bozo union or something uh, you know something having to do with with the original bozo and all the people who play bozo is like the santa claus union or something you know something yes, like that. yes there is well larry Harmon uh, created the bozo the clown figure I see. he owns all the rights to that and uh, he's doing quite well behind it as we say in the modern vernacular. but he didn't invent the word bozo he, oh no 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 <clears throat> bozo comes uh, bozo is as we described in the record actually uh, an, an ancient assumption for clown because it was vosotros it's what the the uh, the dark-skinned peoples Mexican peoples and, and Asi uh, Aztec peoples called the invaders from the Viking lands and from the English lands who were, had red hair and red faces and red noses. Red noses from drinking. And vosotros means stranger. Others. Use, use others. Use, use guys. Others. Use others. Ah. And that's where bozos comes from. Bozo. Is this, is this all explained in the book that, that is out? The book that, that you no, have? No, this is in the record. I know it's in the record, but, but it's, it's hidden in the record. But it's, it's hidden. It's not in my record. Oh, get him out of here, will you please? <laughs> you tried to get me out. Get out. Ugh. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, he left. We put a bag over Every his time head. you turn the radio on, you hear him, you know, trying He's to everywhere. explain what happened. I don't, I'm so tired of it. What do you think of Rosemary Woods? Oh, well, I haven't been there recently, but when I was there, I kind of liked the pine trees. I had a dog, you understand, so I, you know, he liked it more than but I short did. trees, of course, yeah. do like a lot. The trees have probably gotten bigger by now. We have a letter from Rosemary Woods to the Firesign Theater that she wrote. It's uh, true, upon. we do. This is true, by the way, not a put-on. We sent uh, the president a copy of How Can You Be in Two Places at Once When You're Not Anywhere at All. <laughs> yeah, it's part of the Vietnam War protest. Remember, everybody was sending in... I remember the war. And lots yeah. of people were sending... Yes, Yet right. where? Huh? Yet where? Yeah. I remember. And we got a letter back saying, uh, thank you for Dear Firesign Theater, or Dear Mr. Proctor, because Phil sent it yeah. in for us. Thank you for your humorous record. It is helping to complete the president's musical library. Mm -hmm. Yes, exact words. It said, uh, and then a little kind of our gotten double talk, and then it said, uh, and we would like to thank you for supporting the president's position for a fast and honorable peace in Vietnam. Yes. Signed, Rosemary Woods. I hope you framed that. Well, we tried to get it. Columbia to, to publish it as a trade ad, you know, with a little <laughs> note on the top with a picture of, like, a little piece of paper with a uh, paper clip, say, the boss says A-OK, -okay, you know, <laughs> chief gives chief gives nose to fire sign. But uh, they didn't catch the humor of it then. Maybe they'll do it now. I tell you, when I first heard Bozos, though. when I first heard <laughs> the Bozos terrible. album, which was, uh, I guess, like three summers ago. Yeah, it was three summers ago. Mm. I was sitting up on Martha's Vineyard, and... Uh, Oh. The long story behind it, but WBC in Boston. Martha? I well, in in the summers, the late I summers, feel. I couldn't. That that album for me explained everything. Uh oh, there, there was, you are. You see, some people hate that album. No, I yes, I know it. It broke up a relationship I had oh, with someone because are. she hated it. Right. But to for me, it was more important than the girl. There you go. Hey, we're getting glamorous. That's glamorous. But man. no, I'm telling you, that album that, that takes it from like from day one of creation and takes it right up to a little beyond the end. And it explains it. There's yes, nothing, yes, you yes, know yes. then? It's a good one. Now, the Fire Sign Theater's new album, The Tale of the Giant Rat of Sumatra, got a horrible pan yeah. in one of the George Washington University newspapers. And they yeah, said, I think it was George Washington University Savings and Loan newspaper. Yeah. <laughs> said, it said, who, ha who wants to get an album you have to listen to 11 times to understand? Right. I raised my hand, but nobody was watching. <laughs> oh, I, I've listened to Bozo's countless times. I mean, I know people, uh, you know, uh, aside from you two gentlemen, who can... Who can uh, 
you know, verbatim, like spit that back. But you, you don't, you st can still learn from that, you know, for me anyway. Are you going to learn from the, I learned from listening to the Fire Sound Records the same way I learned from listening to anybody I like, whether it's Mick Jagger singing or, you know, Van Morrison or whoever it might be, because technique is something that you can, with a record you can hear again and again and again and listen to it and learn from it, ape it. Let's do, there's, a, there's an excerpt from, uh, from uh, Don't Crush That Dwarf, Pass Me the Pliers that, that you Hand do. Hand me the pliers. Hand me the pliers. Oh, I will. I'd be glad to Pass hear. me the yeah, rope. Yeah. But this, this is one of my favorites, uh, and this is, uh, this is one of my favorites. We'll listen to it right now. 